Well, hello there, folks. Happy Sunday to you. Sunday already again, and I hope that I find you very well indeed, and you are having a good day as well. So a very warm welcome back to What's For Tea and our meals of the week for this week. But if you're new and it's your first time here, my name's Cheryl. We are a family of four from the west coast of Scotland, and it's just what I've made for the family meals during the week to hopefully give you ideas for you and your own family. And if I've done a video recipe, on any of the meals that you see here I will leave them linked underneath in the description box so on Monday we had tagliatelle bolognese so this was made with the quorn mince and I just had to use it up and it actually works really well in these kinds of things you know lasagna bolognese when you put it in with everything else you, you really can't tell the difference or we find it hard to tell the difference so I just combine everything in the one pan a wee bit of parmesan on the top and we also had some garlic pizza bread as well so like I said I do do my sauce separately normally and then cook the pasta separately and then just combine them at the end when they're cooked Moving on to Tuesday, we had chicken curry. I feel as though we hadn't had a curry for absolutely ages. So this was an Indian style butter chicken and I have done a video recipe for this. I will leave in the description box underneath. So I had some pilau rice. This is just the tilde pilau rice. Some chips in the middle, a couple of onion badges. These were from Sainsbury's and that was that wonderful butter chicken there with some coriander on the top. And this was lovely. My mouth is actually watering. This looks like an awful lot of food, but these plates aren't as big as you might imagine. And apologies for next door's dog. He's having a bark to himself. Yeah, I will leave the video rest before that underneath. Moving on to Wednesday, we had tuna pasta bake. Again, one we haven't had for quite a wee while. And we all really do enjoy this. And this is using the Coleman's uh, tuna pasta sashi. And we had a couple of slices of garlic bread on the side. We love garlic bread with pasta. It just goes so well. And moving on to Thursday, we had chicken hot pot. So I had some chicken that I had to use up and loads of tatties that I'm still, you know, still trying to work through. And I have done a video recipe for this one as well. I will leave linked underneath. So it's basically a chicken stew with layers of uh, sliced potato on top done in the oven. And it is really tasty. And we had some munch too and some baby corn on the side as well. We don't have that baby corn very often, but it is really nice. This is it here bubbling away just out of the oven. And moving on to Friday, we had lasagna, another one of our favourites and one I have done a video race before. Again, I will leave linked in the description box underneath if you want to go and watch it. So I had a wee bit of side salad, so some lettuce, cucumber, peppers, tomatoes. That was that lasagna there. I actually done this the day before, so it did set really well and cut really easy. But it was a bit dry, so I made up a quick marinara sauce just for over the top with a few chips on the side and yeah we love marinara sauce I use this for all sorts of things it goes lovely with calzone as well you know if you're having pizza or something and it's a wee bit dry it's nice just to have on the side or even just to pop on the top like I've done here absolutely wonderful and moving on to yesterday we had fish and chips you'd have seen these massive fish in my Aldi shopping haul and they were huge but they were really tasty actually you get two in the box but already had two similar fish in the freezer so I'd done the four but Mr What's For Tea had the massive one obviously with some chips a wee wedge of lemon and some garden peas on the side no tartar sauce this time I did forget to get it but never mind and moving on to today, we had chicken. So yeah, just standard roast chicken. I just done this one in the oven. Sometimes I do it in the slow cooker, but this one was done in the oven with some roast potatoes, a wee bit of mashed sweet, some sweet corn on the side and some lovely chicken gravy and this is one of our favorites you know and folk will say why don't you do a sunday roast every ro you know every week or every sunday and it's just not something i was brought up with you know my mother never made a roast every single week she might do one midweek you know roast beef during the week or roast chicken during the week but it wasn't something we would typically have exclusively on a sunday and i've just kind of kept that going as i've grew older you know but we might have it during the week we might have it a sunday you know it just really depends on what we feel like so that was our meals this week so thank you very much 
for watching and if you're still here thank you ever so much to the supporters of the channel over on my Patreon page and to the channel members here on YouTube and for you all for leaving your lovely comments and for those that share the videos as well you know it's all very much appreciated and if you're not following me on Instagram yet I'm what's for t 3 over there and it would be lovely to see you because obviously I post videos and you know photos and things that don't make it over here to YouTube and here's a wee clip of Jasper here for those who've been asking to see him he is alive and well and thriving and he says hello as well so I'm going to go off now and catch up with you during the week for another wee recipe shopping and bagging or whatever else comes my way so you take care of yourselves and I'll see you off as soon back here on What's For Tea bye now <laughs>